Everyone needs to feel rescued sometimes. I know that was why I found sanctuary in creating Farmhouse Fresh. We have always loved growing fresh botanicals, crafting skincare for spas, and now for you. We like to think our product names, scents, and textures have a little bit of magic in them. Now we get to provide rescue for two. Our customers get a beautiful fresh botanical glow while furry ones get a new home right here on our farm. We hope Farmhouse Fresh can help take care of you while you take care of everything. Hey Farmies, how are you? Happy Friday. <laughs> I'm so excited uh, for the weekend. I hope you guys are too. Hopefully you've had a good week and you're wrapping up your Friday and hopefully you had time to join me today. <laughs> um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Brittany. I am a Farmhouse Fresh educator and a licensed esthetician. And today is a little bit of a redo. <laughs> so if you guys remember a couple weeks back, um, I had a little trouble with some audio and our uh, system, our platform here. So I'm back. I'm kind of redoing the same show, giving you guys some good information if you guys weren't able to join the Instagram that I did later that night. So again, like I said, it's a little bit of a redo <laughs> um, and hopefully you can hear me. Uh, but again, hey guys, how are you? I'm just letting you guys kind of join in. Um, it is a wonderful uh, Friday afternoon here in Texas. It's uh, started to kind of clear up a little bit, hopefully with the rain now that I say that that it'll probably rain today but um, I remember last time I was like it's been raining forever <laughs> so hopefully you guys are having some good summer weather or maybe you're planning for your vacays or you're already on your vacay um, I'll, I'm jealous but <laughs> I'm happy that you guys could join me today um, I've got a good one for you we're really talking about skin rejuvenation today as you probably saw by the title really bringing the life back to your skin um, and just kind of going over some ingredients to look for and really like the top 10 go-to products to really help correct some of those skin concerns that you might have with your skin, whether that be pigmentation, fine lines, wrinkles, just overall kind of like lackluster. So maybe we need to brighten up a little bit, really kind of tightening and firming as well. And some of these products will kind of overlap into the rosacea and acne categories as well. So we'll get into all that too. Um, I'll have an amazing spinning pass for you guys as always. So you're actually going to get a free mighty tiny mask with your purchase. You'll get some free shipping as well. So definitely stick around uh, for the code for that till the end. Um, and I'll give you kind of the instructions on how to, uh, you know, add that in your cart too, because it can be a little bit funny. Um, so just definitely stick around for me and we'll do some Q&A too. So if you guys have any questions, just throw those out for me. I'll be happy to answer those uh, when we get to the end of the video here. But First things first, let's go ahead and dive on into, you know, really the key ingredients that you'll want to look for uh, when it comes to really just kind of like anti-aging and rejuvenation and just overall kind of like reversing the clock, if you will, right? <laughs> so talking about all the skin concerns that I mentioned earlier, um, we'll start with retinol. Retinol, you probably have heard about before. Retinol is very, very, very popular in skincare. It's in a lot of moisturizers, a lot of different serums, a lot of spa treatments and stuff that you may have received before. Retinol is amazing kind of for a lot of different things. So it definitely exfoliates um, the top layer of skin, that epidermis. So you're able to you know, help brighten in, uh, some pigmentation. You're able to help kind of smooth fine lines or wrinkles from a topical standpoint. Um, you're able to brighten the skin as well. Exfoliation always gets off that dead skin buildup and it brightens the skin. Now with it being more of a um, chemical exfoliator is what we call it in uh, the spa world, um, that is actually going to go down to um, you know deeper layers of your skin and help to stimulate cell turnover, which that will give you the long-term correction that you're looking for when it comes to your pigmentation and it comes to your fine lines or wrinkles. 
Retinol can be good for acne as well, though, because a lot of times with acne, you know, there is, of course, always dead skin buildup on the skin. And a lot of times mixed with that oil and then that P. acne bacteria that can sort of cause those breakouts to form. So when we can exfoliate topically and we can go underneath the surface of the skin and really help that cell turnover, it can really help uh, with scarring and it can really help uh, heal and um, get rid of those breakouts a lot faster, which is really important. So retinol is definitely key when it comes to anything rejuvenation, anti-aging. Um, also, peptides are a really, really good ingredient. So I love peptides. If you have, you've probably seen that again too in a lot of skincare, like I say probably within like the last like three to four years, those have really blown up um, in the skincare world. Um, I definitely am a huge fan of them. Um, really what they do is they help, they're an amino acid, which is key to our skin's health, but also it really strengthens the skin. And it also, um, it's like a keratin or a building block, if you will. Um, and it really helps boost the fibroblasts in the skin. Now, fibroblasts are really good for elastin production. So elastin is really what keeps that skin nice and firm and taut. And collagen is what keeps it youthful and plump, right? So we'd always want to work on both. Retinol will help boost that collagen with that cell turnover. Um, but peptides will really strengthen the skin and help to tighten and firm and also uh, really help you with, um, you know, really kind of lifting that skin back up again. And then a lot of, there's a lot of different peptides now where we can actually get other effects out of it too, like brightening. Uh, we can also help with anti-pollution, um, really kind of like an antioxidant effect almost as well, which is really cool. So peptides are awesome. Super, super love those. Um, another thing really is just kind of your key things is like vitamins, your nutrition and your antioxidants as well. So just like we would nourish our bodies when we eat what we, um, you know, our normal diets on a daily basis, we also have to do the same for our skin, right? Our skin's our first line of defense. So the more that we can kind of nourish it and protect it um, with vitamins and antioxidants, that's going to be key. Now, your vitamins, of course, are what's just going to keep it, you know, healthy, keep it looking its best, keep it really uh, moisturized and hydrated. Um, and like I said, healthy is the key. And the antioxidants will give you that sort of protection. So we naturally produce uh, some antioxidants in our body to keep us protected, but our outside doesn't have that. And we do come in contact with a lot of free radical damage uh, or free radicals uh, in the air um, and also just things that we eat and stuff like that. So basically with free radicals, um, we have to neutralize those because they cause a lot of chaos in the skin <laughs> and they actually affect the cells and they can actually destroy the cells over time. So antioxidants are super important, not only internally, but also externally as well, because we can really protect the skin that way too, which will prevent from a lot of the premature aging that you might be seeing. So those fine lines or wrinkles, that pigmentation, those types of things that might be starting to form a little bit earlier than wanted. Um, antioxidants are really going to help you too. And then of course, sunscreen, that's that's always the key. That's like the number one <laughs> anti-ager there, which we'll talk about. Um, but definitely those key things. So like vitamins, antioxidants, peptides, retinol, all of those things are what we're really um, focusing on with these products that I'm going to talk about. Okay. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and jump on into, uh, you know, the product lineup that I've got for you guys. These are really in no particular order. These, like I said, are just sort of the top 10 sort of most rejuvenating, most uh, uh, anti-aging products, if you will, with all of those ingredients in there that we talked about. Okay. So if you guys have never tried one of our facial tonics, um, I definitely recommend them. <laughs> uh, our facial tonics are really cool. They're not just like a toner to rebalance the pH level of the skin. That's definitely what they do. But but they are really your first step in treating the skin. They are packed full of, like I said, all those vitamins, those antioxidants. This one that I'm going to talk about has a bunch of peptides in it. So these are really, really great for being that first layer of treating your skin. So the first one is going to be illumination fruit or illumination juice. Sorry, <laughs> illumination juice. I've got illumination fruit in our lineup too. So that's why I said that. Um, so this one is amazing. You can actually see that separation here. There's actually nine botanical oils in here and 11 super fruits. This one is absolutely amazing. Um, but you do have to shake it up before you use it. That way you can kind of get everything dispersed and it'll kind of turn that kind of like orange juice uh, <laughs> looking color in the bottle here. This one, like I said, is absolutely amazing. Amazing. It's got those super fruits, so you're getting that nourishment and that antioxidant protection that you need. Those nine botanical oils are really going to keep your skin plump, keep it hydrated, and really will bring that brightness to the skin, as well as the peptides in here. So there's actually a 24-hour uh, time-released brightening peptide on this. So the great thing about time-release is that, you know, 
it keeps those waves of illumination coming throughout the day. <laughs> so it really helps to like continuously keep you bright. And then of course those peptides, like I mentioned, are those building blocks for fibroblasts and elastin. So they're really working on uh, firming your skin and kind of toning and tightening at the same time. Um, I love this one. I think it's super nourishing. Um, it smells incredible, you guys. And like I said, if you haven't tried any of them, definitely recommend. This is our newest one that we just launched. So this one is really, really popular right now. And I think it's perfect for summertime because we're always looking for that brightness and that glow, right? <laughs> perfect over like a fresh spray tan or something like that. I absolutely love this one. Definitely check this out. A little bit of aloe vera in there too. So it really kind of like calms the skin. It's very uh, soothing to the skin as well, especially like after sunburn and all of that stuff. <laughs> so next product I'm going to talk about is going to be Crow Catcher. So I absolutely love this one. If you've never seen this one or used this one, again, definitely recommend. I talk about this one often. <laughs> this is actually our eye transforming serum. Let me go a little bit closer. So our eye transforming serum. However, I use it all over to spot treats. So again, this is packed full of peptides. So think toning, tightening, lifting, firming with this right here. Also a little bit of brightening as well. There's some aloe vera again in here, some go-to cola. We also have um, some algae and some seaweed extracts too. So incredible for those vitamins, those antioxidant protection that we're looking for against that free radical damage that causes that damage to our cells and that premature aging, right? So absolutely love this. Again, I love the consistency and the, the soothing, cooling aspect of it as well because it's a serum. Super lightweight, you guys. I mean, really any skin type could use this. So no matter if you're really, really dry and you need a lot of hydration or you're really oily and you're like worried about, you know, creams and stuff, how they kind of leak into the eye a little bit throughout the day, you don't have to worry about that at all. This one really is a great uh, consistency. It absorbs like a dream. Um, really works for everybody. So, um, and you can use it on that upper eyelid as well, which is great. Um, and you can use it twice a day. There's nothing really exfoliating in there. So you don't have to worry about it making you sun sensitive or anything like that. And then my favorite way to use it is of course under and above the eye. It's really inside that orbital bone, which is great. And then I love it for the 11s here. I love it for the nasal, nasal labial folds, our marionette lines. And then I even will take it down to the neck, kind of like this line across here. And even on the chest as well, if you're a side sleeper like myself, those lines are starting to form. So definitely uh, putting it right there just to spot treat those areas where we're getting a little bit more of those fine lines or wrinkles. Those peptides will help to smooth that out and really tone and tighten the skin again. So love, love, love <laughs> that little serum right there. Um, really, like I said, it's, it's our eye transforming serum, but you can use it in other ways. So I'm obsessed with it. One of my faves. Um, next product is actually going to be a watermelonade. So this one right here is like really my holy grail. I mean, you guys know, like <laughs> if you've ever watched my videos before, I probably talk about this product literally every video like this, like for sure is my holy grail. I'm obsessed with this product, you guys. This is actually going to be in our high bio hemp collection. So it's going to have about 170 milligrams of CBD per jar in here, which is incredibly calming and soothing to the skin. If you have rosacea like me or just a lot of redness or inflamed acne. Um, but the great thing about CBD is that it's also anti-aging because what it does is it reduces inflammation in the skin, which we know internally and externally inflammation causes a lot of premature aging. So inflammation definitely don't want, um, this will calm that inflammation down for you, which again, will prevent some of those signs of fine lines, wrinkles, pigmentation, those types of things. So love this. Um, this also is going to have some vitamin C in here, which is that great antioxidant. It's also a brightener too. And there's some licorice root in here too, which again is a natural whitener brightener. So we're looking for glowy skin, rejuvenated, again, and bring life back to the skin, especially if you've kind of been feeling like your skin's been a little bit dull lately or a little bit lackluster. I love this one because um, it really will help brighten the skin back up. And then I'll show you guys the consistency of this too. So this is very thin. It is hyaluronic acid based. So what that means is it actually really will plump up your skin and hyaluronic acid will lock in moisture as well. So it's great, again, to keep you hydrated throughout the day, but it's in that wonderful thin serum consistency. So again, it's not too heavy. It doesn't feel like you've got something on your skin, even if you're super oily, or again, if you're really uh, needing a lot of hydration, if you're on the drier side like myself, still has a ton of good uh, vitamins and antioxidants in there to really help keep you hydrated. That hyaluronic acid holding in that moisture, so locking everything in without weighing the skin down. So. Um, 
um, hyaluronic acid is actually something we naturally produce uh, in our skin as well, but we have an enzyme that kind of breaks that down. It, um, it's supposed to break down the bad stuff, but it doesn't really differentiate between the good and the bad. So it actually kind of eats away a little bit at our hyaluronic acid naturally that we produce as we age, okay? So that is really important to have a lot of products that have uh, that hyaluronic acid in there too, to kind of replenish what we're naturally losing um, as we age. So obsessed with that serum, you guys. It works for all skin types. Um, it has that wonder wonderful watermelon scent to it, which has some great lycopene in there, which is a great antioxidant as well. So protection, brightness, hydration, a lightweight formula, that CBD to help calm and soothe redness and inflamed acne and also prevent premature aging. Really just can't go wrong with this <laughs> one right here. I'm obsessed with it. Um, next product, you guys, is going to be a serum that you can use at nighttime. So watermelonate, of course, you can use it both morning and night. No, exfoliator in there. So it really isn't going to make you sun sensitive. Neither does this one. However, it really works best at nighttime because it works with our circadian rhythms. So this one right here is our wind down serum. This is our old packaging. Um, <laughs> I was thinking of my last video. I was like, for the life of me, I can't find the new one and I still have product in here. So I'm just going to go ahead and use it till, <laughs> till it runs out and I need a new one. Um, but this one is great. If you do get the new packaging, it'll be like a frosted glass. It's really cute. I love it. Um, this has this darker uh, tone and texture to it. I'm going to show you. You can see that right there. So this actually has Merlot in it. This has uh, resveratrol from Merlot particularly. Um, so it just absorbs super nicely there. Um, that's what gives it that color and that kind of hue to it. Um, that resveratrol is an amazing antioxidant that we find in a lot of wines um, that can really um, fight that free radical damage and reverse a lot of those uh, premature aging signs and really boost the cell's overall health and its cellular function, which again is important as we age because all of that starts to slow down. Um, so it's great. And like I said, it works for nighttime. And that was very tall, really works as we sleep. Um, that's really when our body's repairing itself. So it's perfect pairing for nighttime. I love that serum. Again, very thin formula. So great for oily skin, all the way to dry skin, really works for everybody. Um, there's some amazing peptides in there too, which will really, uh, you know, work on that lifting and firming too. Um, and it does provide 24 hours of hydration. Um, so it still will give you a lot of plumping to your skin. You'll wake up, it'll be very bright, uh, nice and tight. Um, we'll, uh, again, working on those signs of fine lines, wrinkles, pigmentation, all of those things. And then it really boosts uh, the cells. So I would say actually after about 30 days, you should start noticing um, really a big change in your skin. Um, so definitely, definitely recommend that serum <laughs> really again for everybody um, who's kind of looking to combat that. Now, next I'm going to talk about a moisturizer. So this one right here is kind of like our OG with our stronger retinol. Um, now we've come out with our moon dips and, you know, our mighty brighty uh, sleep delay. So that's something that um, you guys may want to check out too. If you really are, uh, you know, worried about that lacklusterness, that one is perfect. Um, but this one right here, this one has a 2% pure retinol in here. This is our watercress hydration cascade. And the amazing thing about that retinol, again, like I mentioned, it's going to work for um, acne. It's going to work to exfoliate. It's going to work to brighten the skin. And that retinol is going to go deeper and it's really going to boost that cell turnover. So we're helping collagen. We're helping over time reverse and kind of soften and smooth those fine lines or wrinkles. And we're also working on that pigmentation as well. So pigmentation sometimes is a little funny and it can be hard to treat. Um, that's why retinol is really good for it because sometimes it's not always so superficial. It's like, yeah, the spot just popped up. I should be able to get rid of it fast, but it could be an underlying damage cell that was, you know, that's been there a long time. It's just now kind of made its way up to the top, right? Because our cells do this, right? So um, definitely that can be something like it doesn't want to go away. It's been there a long time. <laughs> so that retinol is great uh, because it really, like I said, it goes down deeper into the skin and it works on those underlying layers where that pigmentation could lie. So it can really brighten that up. Um, again, over time, really smooth those fine lines and wrinkles. And this has some incre incredible vitamins and antioxidants in here as well. This has got blue matcha, which of course gives it that color and that uh, sort of light blue to it. This also has an anti-pollution uh, peptide in here. So again, those peptides are incredible. Um, this one will actually, again, combat a lot of the free radical damage um, and stuff that's coming 
contact with. Um, this also is going to have a farmhouse fresh grown cucumber extract too, um, and watermelon or uh, watercress, uh, hence the name. Um, and so again, that is chock full of a lot of good nourishment for you and also really potent antioxidants, lots and lots and lots of vitamin C. So it'll really brighten your skin and also help to protect, which is super important, especially as we age, because our skin just starts to get a little bit thinner. It doesn't repair itself like it used to, because again, that cell turnover is slowing down. So again, the more damage that we do uh, in an early age, of course, that will affect us and we'll get that premature aging. But also as we age, we have to continuously think of that. We have to, you know, keep protecting it because it's only um, going to unfortunately get a little bit harder for it to protect itself. Okay. So love this product because again, you've got that 2% pure retinol in here. It's time released as well. So you're not going to get any redness from this, no irritation, no flakiness that maybe you've gotten from some retinols in the past, which is amazing. And then it's mixed in with your moisturizer. And the great thing is, is that it's encapsulated. So you don't have to worry about that retinol getting messed up by mixing that moisturizer with it. That encapsulation will allow it to actually absorb into the skin at the same time that you've got that moisturization and that hydration on the outer layer of the skin to really plump it back up and also not uh, worry about its effectiveness as well. So you'll still get the results you're looking for with the retinol. And then again, you don't have to do that, that waiting period, that two-step process where you've got to put your retinol on, you've got to wait 10 minutes and then put your moisturizer on, which a lot of times before bed, we're just like slapping stuff on, right? <laughs> we're like, I'm just ready for bed, put, 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 cleanse my skin, put on my skincare, go to bed, right? So we don't have to do that waiting period with this as well, which is awesome. So love this, you guys. Um, as you can see the consistency here, so this again is like watermelonade. It's got that hyaluronic acid, um, really nice delay, um, you know, consistency to it. It's just, again, super thin, super lightweight, but still loaded with all those vitamins, antioxidants, that hydration that we're looking for. And again, that hyaluronic acid is going to plump that skin back up and really lock in that hydration too. So this is great for, um, you know, specifically for nighttime. You can use it during the day. But again, we always want to recommend a sunscreen when it comes to retinol products because you are exfoliating that top layer with that retinol. Okay, so keep that in mind. Um, I wouldn't take it on a vacation with you and use it in the morning if you're going to get sun. Just again, that 2% retinol, even though we don't get that redness and irritation, we tend to be a little bit fooled with it. Um, don't, you know, don't, don't get in that mindset of like, you know, I'll be okay. Definitely wear your sunscreen with it, you know, use it at night um, and make sure that uh, you know that it's exfoliating your skin. Okay. Just keep that in mind. <laughs> with summer coming up, I just want to mention that as an esthetician, because we do run into some problems with retinol and stuff like that. Um, next product I'm going to recommend. I, this is actually serum and oil, so it can go in the serum category, but I like to use it as a sort of like moisturizer topper, if you will. <laughs> so I use it a little bit differently. Um, and you've got some options to play with here, but this product is going to be supremely lit. So this, again, like I said, is our serum and oil. It is in our high biohemp collection. So this, again, has that CBD, just like watermelonade has in it. So we're helping with inflammation with this. We're helping with redness and soothing the skin and preventing that premature aging, of course, as that inflammation causes. So this is amazing. Um, I'm very dry and dehydrated, so I gravitate towards, you know, more of the kind of oil-based products. Um, but so I love that kind of dewy, glowy, you know, kind of like, you know, like you've got a little bit of, of a shine going. I like that for my skin again, because I'm dehydrated. My skin looks very dull, lackluster. So I like that look. That's why I use it over top of my moisturizer, over top of my watercress. I'll put um, just a little bit on. All you need is that much, just a tiny little bit. And then what I'll do is I'll like kind of emulsify it like that. Just get it all over my hands. You can kind of see that there. And then I'll just pat that into my skin everywhere. And that is literally all you need. You don't need a ton. You're going to get kind of greasy and, <laughs> and slippery uh, everywhere. If you, um, you know, if you go crazy with the pumps, just a, like barely a half a pump is all you need. Okay. And just press that into the skin. And I love it, love it, love it over top of my moisturizer. So if you're going to go out like without, um, you know, makeup on or something like that, I think it's really pretty. I like the way that that looks like that kind of dewy glow to the skin. Um, but again, you always, use it as your serum. That's what it's made to do. So it's made to go, you know, of course, under moisturizer. Um, so you can definitely use it as your serum step, not a problem at all. Um, and again, same thing, just about a half a pump, kind of still press that into the skin. That way you're not kind of, you know, rubbing and things like that. Um, and it really, really does work to um, help hydrate the skin, really uh, bring that glow back. But most importantly, 
It also has those antioxidants. It has a brightener in there too, uh, which is vitamin C. And then it actually has a very unique ingredient called sea berry fruit extract. So sea berry fruit is really cool because it is like an incredible antioxidant. It's it's super, super potent, um, way more like, you know, just on a scale from like blueberries to sea berry fruit, it's like way over here on the scale. <laughs> so it is incredible, incredible, incredible for protection. Really, again, a lot of those antioxidants will neutralize that free radical damage that we talked about. So we can prevent that premature aging as well by using this on a daily basis. So again, this could be your serum. This could be your moisturizer as is, or you can put it over top of your moisturizer like I do as like a little bit of a dewy glow finish. Okay, so get some options there. Definitely check that one out. I love it, love it, love it. Now, like I mentioned earlier, uh, sunscreen is our number one uh, skin anti-ager. It will definitely um, keep that skin rejuvenated because that is what it does. It is there for protection. It is there to keep that skin um, in its same state, right? We know that that sun is, um, you know, very damaging to our skin on an external level. Um, so really, sunscreen is your best bet as far as really, you know, you know, protecting from the sun um, on a topical level. So that is going to be our elevated shade here. Now this product is a really cool product. This is 100% mineral. So if you're not a fan of chemical sunscreens, you're like, ugh, they just kind of break me out or maybe they look too greasy on the skin and you really want to switch to a mineral, this one is awesome. It is completely reef safe. Again, 100% mineral. It's a 21% uh, active zinc oxide. So that's actually very high um, as far as uh, a lot of the, you know, SPFs out out there and it is an SPF 30 which is what is recommended for a daily basis and the great thing about it too is that it's not only for face but you can use it for body as well so if you like again you know something a little bit more mattifying a little bit more oil free you don't like that kind of like greasy feeling <laughs> like some of the chemical sunscreens can do then I love the mineral for the body as well um, it also of course we're a skincare company we're gonna chock it full of goodies so it's got niacinamide in it it's also got some great vitamins some hyaluronic acid and sodium PCA so it will still hydrate your skin as well. So it almost acts as a moisturizer too, which is amazing, but it still has that very mattified oil-free look. So if you are on the oily side and you just hate the way that sunscreen sort of wear on your skin throughout the day, you'll love it. And then even somebody who's dry like myself, what I do is I just take a little tiny bit out. I'll kind of show you guys there. You just need like that much. That is literally all you need. And then again, I do the same thing that I do with like my Supremely Lit. I'll kind of emulsify it in my hands here, just get it all over. And then I just go ahead and pat that into my skin. Again, I don't like the, you know, the swiping and the rubbing method. It just over time that kind of pulls on the skin a lot and that can cause a premature aging as well. So kind of patting, you know, any oils or anything that's kind of a little bit more mattified or oil free that kind of tugs a little bit on the skin. That's best to just kind of pat that in. Um, and it just, again, will absorb and it doesn't feel heavy and you're not having to pull or tug on the skin. So that's super important as well to remember. All right. Um, so that's my favorite way to use it. Um, I use it every single day. Um, you can of course reapply with it as well. Um, it feels really, really nice. Um, and then also, so, um, you know, mixed in with moisturizers too. I know that sometimes that can be an issue as well. I've never had a problem with any of the moisturizers that I've used with it. So whether that be watercress or that's one of the moon dips, or again, one of the oils um, that I kind of top my skin with, I've never had a problem with it kind of sitting weird or, you know, getting kind of funky throughout the day or anything like that. So I, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm dry, dehydrated, rosacea. Um, so that's my skin. I've never had any issues. Um, so I think you guys will be fine no matter if you're on the dry side like me or if you're oily as well, because it and it's got that oil-free mattified uh, finish. So love that one. Again, number one anti-ager. We can't protect from the sun enough. <laughs> so definitely sunscreen is important, you guys. So that's kind of like your uh, daily products here, but I've got some masks and some treatment boosters for you as well, which is important because again, our skin will start to plateau. It's very smart. Um, it starts to recognize what we're doing and then it kind of starts to plateau after a while, which is why a lot of people are like, you should switch your skincare up all the time. Um, not necessarily true, but if we can uh, boost it and um, you know give it a little bit of a treatment um, you know, throughout the week, uh, that can really help the skin not to start to do that, right? Then it'll continuously still uh, respond respond to your uh, normal skincare that you use. So the first one I want to talk about is going to be Illumination Fruit. Like I mentioned earlier, you guys, I said Illumination Fruit when I was talking about juice, <laughs> our facial tonic, but this one is awesome. Um, this really is like our most results driven mask here. So when we're talking about skin rejuvenation and brightening and anti-aging, I mean, 
this is like number one for me, in my opinion. Um, this definitely has this amazing texture here. It smells incredible. It's like crushed berries. Um, it has a 5% malic, a 5% lactic, a 5% citric, and even a 2% mandelic acid in here. So this is considered our professional strength peel. However, the great thing about it is that it doesn't um, penetrate past that top layer of skin as far as like, you know, the physical ingredients in there. So you don't have to worry about neutralizing it or doing anything, you know, uh, at home, um, you know, other than just removing it like you normally would like a mask, just a cool towel, remove that. Um, you are going to get flushed with this and you are going to feel some heat rise to the skin. You may even feel a little bit of tingling as well. That's totally normal. Those acids that are in there are really stimulating exfoliation and they're also oxygenating the skin. So what that does is it stimulates blood flow and it brings a lot of oxygen to the surface. Number one, to brighten. Number two, oxygen is what our cells need to live right? Um, so oxygen is super important when it comes to cellular health and cellular rejuvenation um, because that oxygen is really what makes those cells healthy, right? So if we can oxygenate the skin, it really, really, um, you know, boosts uh, as all the anti-aging properties that we're looking to get out of it. So absolutely love it. Um, it's got, of course, some enzymes in there too, and some physical exfoliant. So you'll feel a little bit of a granular uh, as you put it on, um, mechanical exfoliation, and that's totally normal. We want to feel that. And as you're removing, you could even do a little bit of a buffing action if you want to, just very slow circular motions, you know, don't go too crazy or anything like that. You know, you've already let it sit on the skin. Um, so it's done what it's needs to do. But if you have a lot of texture, maybe like throughout your nose or like on your forehead or your chin, um, you could do a little bit of buffing action. I should remove it if you want to. Um, anyway, you guys, so like I said, you're going to get um, some heat, some flushing, a little bit of tingling, totally normal. The first time you apply it, we really recommend one to three minutes just to gauge your skin and see how it's going to react. If you've never used this mask before, we always want to make sure we stay on the lower end as far as time wise, because we don't want to have any reactions. You know, it's something new that your skin's never experienced before. So you always want to be on the safe side with that. So first time you use it, one to three minutes. And then after that, you can kind of up your time a little bit, like next time, five to seven minutes, next time up to 10 minutes. And then like your fourth time, you could go up to the 15 minute mark without probably any issues at all. And 15 minutes would be you know, like your max time on that. We don't want to go past that 15 minute mark. You don't need to anyway. Like I said, it's already done when it needs to do at that time. Um, so definitely just kind of like work your way up to that time frame. And then it's up to you as far as, um, you know, like I said, I would kind of do, I would, I would do like once a week for the first month. That's always really good just to like kickstart that those cells and like really boost the skin and almost do like a little bit of, um, you know, like if you were to do a deeper peel on your skin, like in the treatment room, I love to do that once a week for a month and then kind of do like every other week after that, like twice a month or just once a month as like your booster, right? So I love, love, love this mask. Um, I really think it works in great combination with spa treatments as well. So if you're prepping your skin for maybe like some microneedling services or again, a deeper chemical uh, chemical peel, um, or if your esthetician recommends maybe doing that booster in between uh, those peels every four to six weeks or your facials, I think it's a great product for that too, because it can really just enhance those results that you're getting with your esthetician in the treatment room. And again, just, you know, give you some boosting at home as well. So your skin doesn't plateau with your skincare products. So obsessed with that mask, you guys definitely try it. Um, definitely our most results driven mask as far as taking care of those fine lines and wrinkles and pigmentation. And again, um, you know, kind of the acne blemishes and all of that over time as well. So next mask I'm going to talk about is more of a complexion enhancing mask, um, not necessarily going like super deep or, you know, not quite as exfoliating as Illumination Fruits. If you're looking for something to use more on a regular basis, maybe twice a week, then you could go with our Sunday Best. So this one is amazing. This is our chocolate softening mask, you guys. Basically just think like antioxidants, antioxidants, antioxidants in this mask right here. This is like chock full of those incredible antioxidants to protect your skin and of course, fight all of that free radical damage and that chaos uh, causing free radicals um, in the skin, okay? So ginseng in here, we've got coenzyme Q10, we've got live carrot cells as well, tons of vitamins. Of course, that chocolate, that cocoa powder as well is a great antioxidant on its own. And then we've got some great hydrating properties in here too. So we've got a little bit of honey, we've got some coconut oil. So we're really pulling in moisture and hydrating the skin. At the same time that we've got some kaolin clay um, and to really help to 
um, you know, pull out some impurities and also still oxygenate the skin. So just like we're getting that oxygen stimulation and that blood flow stimulation from illumination fruit, this will also do that for you as well. So you may feel some some tightening, a little bit of tingle with this too, maybe even a little bit of pinkness just throughout the cheeks when you remove uh, with this mask right here because that oxygenation is really important when it comes to anti-aging as we know. So this one right here, if you're somebody who, I think this is more for you know, kind of your more normal to dry skin types. Definitely an oily skin type isn't going to break out from this or anything like that. But as far as like the honey and the um, coconut oil and things like that, and there's very, very hydrating. So I would recommend kind of more for that normal to dry skin. And then the next one I'll talk about is more a little bit for uh, our oily skin types, um, or you could do a little combination. So if you wanna plump up, you know, some drier areas, but also kind of take care of some blackheads or some oilier areas with this next one, you could do a little multi-mask situation. So Sunday, best first but then you could go in with your mighty tidy so this one right here is our turmeric and banana tightening mask so like i mentioned this will definitely oxygenate just like the other two which is super important this has got some great antioxidants in here as well but basically this has really got um that super like it's so funny like if you if you put it on one half of your face versus the other half you're gonna get this like super tightening and toned <laughs> side over here and this will still look like you know uh, a little bit saggy over here so this is really an incredible mask for picking everything up lifting and firming toning tightening that's what we're looking for i love it for like a neck and chest add-on if you've got a little bit of loose skin there as well and then this is great like i said if you want to do a little multi-mask situation with sunday best say like my cheeks are super dry um like with my rosacea so i want to you know kind of put that throughout here maybe my forehead as well but like i really want to pick up and lift and firm my jawline and my neck and my nasal labial folds so i'll do a little bit of mighty tidy like on the lower half of my face and down the neck so you could do that as well and like really pick up and lift this and then hydrate and plump this up and work on fine lines and wrinkles that might be forming there so obsessed with this combination you guys um and it's like a chocolate and a banana it's it's awesome. I love it. Uh, the Mighty Tidy as well also has some turmeric oil. So it really helps to like, like brighten the skin as well and help with unevenness. So if you do have some things like pigmentation or maybe even melasma or again, the, that acne scarring, if you've got some of those darker spots, this can really help you with that unevenness of the skin. Now, Keep in mind, this doesn't have any retinol in it, so it's not going to work on a deeper level as far as correcting it you know, completely. But from a topical standpoint, this will brighten up your skin and really help the way that that looks on the surface, which is great. You know, Again, if you've got an event or you've got to be on camera or something like that, or you're gonna be taking some pictures and you want that to look a little bit brighter and better underneath your makeup, then this is perfect for that too. So I love that turmeric in here as well. And the banana pulp has some great vitamin A. So that's again gonna give you a little bit of light exfoliation and really bright in the skin as well. So not only does it tighten, tone, <laughs> firm, brighten the skin, protect those clays, again, will oxygenate. Um, it really just, uh, you know, just it gives you this instant kind of like rejuvenated, <laughs> you know, lift and firm and glow to your skin. So obsessed with this mask as well. Now, you guys, um, I promised you a spending pass. So that is actually going to be Rejuvenate One. And that will actually get the last mask that we talked about, your Mighty Tidy, completely for free with a $60 purchase. And you'll qualify for free shipping with that as well. Okay, so super cool. Rejuvenate One is going to be your code. Um, and also, you'll, um, like I, I kind of mentioned, it's a little bit uh, funny to get it in your car to make the code apply. If you don't add it to your car, before you go to checkout, it'll tell you that the code is invalid. So just so that you guys know that, um, it'll give you an error message. So you just want to make sure that you've got your $60 worth of product, then go ahead and add your Mighty Tidy mask in. And then when you go to your cart and you apply uh, Rejuvenate One, it will zero this out for you and make it completely free. Okay. So definitely want you guys to um, to take advantage of that. It's a good, uh, good promo, um, completely free. That's a $30 value, which is awesome. And then also, um, you get that free shipping with it too, which is super cool. Um, so I definitely want you guys to take advantage. Um, if you have any questions for me, go ahead and send those in. Cause I'm going to jump into Q and a real quick. Um, and then, yeah, if you guys have any questions about these products or just farmhouse fresh stuff in general, maybe some other products you have at home, maybe combining some of these products with some of the other products you have at home, or if you guys have tried any of the new mighty Brighty stuff, or illumination uh, juice, um, definitely let me know and I want to hear your feedback as well. So uh, send those questions in to me. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get this pulled up and see if I can't see those for you. 
Okay, let's see what you guys have for me. Okay, so I have got, what is the best for hyperpigmentation? Three milk night cream or your new one? Okay, so I love three milk night cream. Um, that one definitely is, uh, got a lot of peptides in it, so it will lift and firm. It does help to brighten the skin, um, and it, it is really hydrating and creamy. Um, I would say, though, specifically for pigmentation, you're going to want some things that's targeting um, the pigmentation and brightening up the skin at the same time. So I would recommend trying that Mighty Brighty uh, Sleep Gelay. Um, I definitely think, like, like I said, again, if you're looking for that brightening and really targeting the pigmentation, it would work best for you. It's got this wonderful lavender scent to it. It's chock full chock full <laughs> of brightening peptides and, and uh, uh, vitamins as well. That vitamin C is really uh, prevalent in that too. Um, I've actually got it next to me, <laughs> believe it or not. I've got, I can actually show you guys what this looks like. Um, so you guys can see that as far as the consistency goes, you can see it's still actually pretty thin, like comparatively to the Three Milk Night Cream. I say it's even thinner. Um, it has a really nice, almost kind of like serum-y type of consistency as well. I'll kind of scoop a little bit out too so you can see that. So I definitely think that um, depending on your texture preference as well, this is going to be thinner. Um, I definitely think Three Milk... Um, sleep cream is a little bit thicker. Uh, so if you're, if you're just like super dry and super dehydrated, like myself, I love three milk, but this is still hydrating enough for me. I love this. Um, even if you want to do a little double layer combo, you could do that too. <laughs> if you're extra like me, um, then you would do that. Um, but I'll just kind of show you guys right here. So I just kind of worked that into my skin. So super thin, um, yeah, it doesn't feel heavy or anything like that. I would, I would gravitate towards mighty brighty just specifically because you're looking to help with that pigmentation. Okay, let's see what what, you, what else you guys got for me. Okay, so I've got the question, 24 hour time release, isn't it washed off when you wash? Okay, so once that absorbs into the skin, as you know, cleansers only go so deep, right? They only go so far, they just cleanse off the topical layer of makeup, oil, dirt buildup, and then they can get into those pores. But they don't actually go into the skin um, uh, to cleanse the skin on the deeper levels, right? Um, so you don't have to really worry about that. As you have applied it in the morning time or just overnight, if you want to do that, um, you're, once it absorbs into the skin, those peptides will be absorbed and they'll start working and that encapsulation will start to start to go um, and they'll start the time release. So you don't have to worry about cleansing or washing that off um, when you cleanse the next morning or again, you know, that night. So even if it's been, you know, just 12 hours, they're still going to continuously hydrate and brighten your skin after that, uh, after that 12 hour period or after that first cleanse, they'll still be able to work. Hopefully that makes sense. <laughs> Maybe I just confused you more, but <laughs> basically, like I said, once that it's thin enough to go into the skin is what I'm trying to say. So once those peptides have gone into the skin and they've absorbed and they're starting to work, they'll continuously work even if you do a cleanse after that. Hopefully that is, makes a little bit more sense for you because that cleanser doesn't go past that layer where those peptides have absorbed. Okay. All right. So let me see. I've got, when do I use wine down versus chocolate fig? Okay. So this is a good one. So chocolate fig is really a good, like we call it our vitamin recovery serum. So it is chock full of vita vitamins with the figs and the raspberries and stuff that are in there. It's also got enzymes in it. So it's got pineapple papaya enzymes to gently um, lift off dead skin buildup. So it's gently exfoliating your skin. Okay. So keep that in mind. Um, wind down doesn't have anything in there that like physically exfoliates the skin. So if you, again, are somebody who has a lot of texture um, or, you know, again, a lot of blackheads, things like that, even if you're on the drier side, like myself, sometimes I can tend to get a little bit clogged and stuff. So I actually like chocolate fig if I'm kind of dealing with a little bit of that. Um, but wind down and you could use that, you know, during the day, you can use that at night too. Either way, enzymes don't make you sun sensitive. So you don't really have to worry about that. Um, now wind down, like I said, specifically because it, that resveratrol works better overnight. Um, I would recommend your chocolate fig in the morning and then your wind down at nighttime because it specifically works a little bit better for overnight time. Um, as it's neutralizing that, those free radicals, and infusing those antioxidants to really help protect the skin. So that's what I would do. I would do chocolate fig during the morning and then wind down at nighttime. However, um, like I said, there's nothing exfoliating and wind down. You could use it during the day. You could, there, 
they're universal. You can you can do them either way. You're not going to hurt yourself if you accidentally mixed them up and you used wine down in the morning and chocolate fig at night. You'll be fine. You don't have to worry about that. But like I said, just as far as a recommendation goes, that chocolate fig will help keep you uh, protected, um, brightened throughout the day. It's also got a lot of like aloe, honey in there to really hydrate your skin. So that would be a good combination for daytime. And then that wine down at night would be would be my recommendation. That would be best for you. Okay. All right. So let's see if you guys have any more questions for me here. Okay. If you don't, that is totally fine. You guys can, um, I'll refresh here in just a minute uh, to see if you guys have any more, but um, you guys can always email our uh, skin experts at farmhousefreshgoods.com. If you guys have any questions, um, we have an esthetician um, who is you know, checking that regularly and she can answer your questions for you. She also does virtual consultations as well. So if you really just need like really individualized, um, you know, so, uh, you know, advice, um, then she'll be uh, more than willing to help you with that. Um, and then also you guys, I'm going to mention one more time that code in case you have to jump off. Um, that is going to be for your free mighty tidy mask. Remember toning, tightening, brightening with this oxygenation, absorbing excess oils, helping with blackheads. Um, <laughs> just absolutely amazing mask helping with unevenness brightening the skin um, all the things so you'll get that for free with your uh, code rejuvenation one remember to add your products and then add that mighty tidy in and then uh, when you go to check out apply that code and that will zero at your mask for you you'll get it completely for free and you'll also qualify for free shipping as well which is awesome so I want you to take advantage of that rejuvenation one again is that code and I will just double check one more time here just to make sure you guys don't have any more questions for me all right, I think we're good. So I will go ahead and let you guys go. Have an amazing weekend. Um, I don't normally do Fridays, so it was fun to chat with you this afternoon. And again, hope you have an amazing Friday, um, an amazing weekend. Um, you know, like I said, it's June, it's summertime. <laughs> I hope you hope you hope you enjoy. Um, it was so nice to be with you. My name is Brittany. I will see you guys next time on Farm. Everyone needs to feel rescued sometimes. I know that was why I found sanctuary in creating Farmhouse Fresh. We have always loved growing fresh botanicals, crafting skincare for spas, and now for you. We like to think our product names, scents, and textures have a little bit of magic in them. Now we get to provide rescue for two. Our customers get a beautiful, fresh botanical glow while furry ones get a new home right here on our farm. We hope Farmhouse Fresh can help take care of you while you take care of everything. everything.